I'm Chris Mosley, and this is Comment Section News. But the comment section is the news. Let's get it. And our top story, Thanksgiving has passed. However, the leftover feeling of hurt and embarrassment is still on this young man as he tried to make a dish for his family. Oh, this is nasty. Years, I told you that shit was nasty. You no good cooking motherfucker. I tell you one thing, Uncle Edward better not need that few help when it come down to uh, uh, who get to go to the nursing home and like get your ass in a rot. <laughs> On to the comment section where someone says, Uncle ain't holding shit in. Calicia says, I feel bad and I ain't even cooking. Someone else says, How you gonna cook for someone then get cooked? Well, young man, it looks like next year you better stick to just bringing the paper plates and the silverware. <laughs> Unless you plan on f***ing that up, too. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> on to the next story. Uh, a a up-and-coming rapper with a very unique look films a music video. Fuck you, bitches, will get my mind different. Please don't get it twisted, my bitches, my spine different. Mm -hmm. If you thought I liked it, I'll be a crime victim. Y'all f***ing on these niggas, I'll be here, they get dressed. <laughs> hey, I admire that confidence, bro. But okay, okay, can I ask a question? Can we get the name and number of that car dealership? Because whatever truck that is, I need two of them. Because if you carrying loads like that, bro. Sorry. The caption said to guess her rap name. To which someone said, "Obesity, Meg the Galleon, kilograms." <laughs> hey, bro. I'm not piling on, bro. But you ever seen 600 pound life? You know when they got a certain amount of time to lose the weight so they can get the surgery, but they spend that whole time bullshitting? Like, don't just look like that. Like, she's supposed to be on a scale, uh, on a treadmill, doing something still. You are shooting music videos, got your dog licking all on you. <clears throat> Continuing on with even more music. Here's another young man trying to make his rap dreams come true. Her skin's like peanut butter, her boot is like jelly. Peanut butter jelly, peanut peanut butter jelly. Why you hating? She got your mans on her celly. Peanut butter jelly, peanut peanut butter jelly. Her skin's like peanut butter, her boot is like jelly. Peanut butter jelly, peanut peanut butter jelly. Why you hating? She got your mans on her celly. Peanut butter jelly, peanut peanut butter jelly. Man, look, about 10 years ago, this might have been considered trash. But today's music, shit, put him on the BET Awards tonight, nigga. Get the number one peanut butter and jelly. On to the comments section where someone says, I want this on GTA Radio. I'm telling my son this was big and small. Hey, Brad, don't you get mad when songs be so simple and they make so much money? It's like, damn, I could have made that, bro. I could have definitely made that song. You know what I'm saying? I can make a song right now. Hey. Brush that tongue, bitch. Hey, brush that tongue, bitch. Hey, a nigga, brush that tongue, bitch. Hey, then I'ma say you the one, bitch. Hey. Just trying to make it. Just trying to make it. <clears throat> On to the last story. As the ceiling challenge has taken social media by storm, uh, it's basically having thousands and hundreds of thousands of women all over the world putting their cell phones on the ceiling. Getting down on the ground and shaking that monkey. Push the fucking. Well, I guess she brought a new meaning to the term throwing it back. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I bet any amount of money, there was a couple people in that room that was happy that she fell. You know what I'm saying? Because she was cute. So it's like, if somebody jealous in that mother, like, yeah, that's what you get. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> um, <clears throat> on to the comic section where someone says, push the f***ing chair and make her fall down. Sorry. We continue on as someone says, I tried to catch you in my head, but I just wasn't quick enough. The Lord said, thou shalt sit down somewhere. Put some new batteries in those smoke detectors while you at it. Hey, you know, that post actually had a lot of comments of people asking if she was okay and making sure she was good. And I wanted to believe that people was being nice, but I, I thought then I did I not remember it. Oh, pretty privilege. Because had she not looked like that, had she looked a little less, had she been a 3 out of 10, it'd have been like, ah, that's what you don't look <laughs> That concludes this episode of Comment Section News. 
I'm Chris Mosley.